Well, I probably shouldn't be telling the story, but one day I had my brazen glasses up on my forehead and got flux in my eye. I said, dude, I gotta get some of those flip-up glasses. <laughs> now I'm all set. My name's Sean. I'm Ryan Waters. Keith Rouse. My name is Phil. Chris Rowe. I'm the lead painter. I'm the production manager at Independent Fabrication. I do graphic work and paint work. I'm a finisher and a painter. I'm a welder at Independent Fabrication. And I love what I do. Um, well, I've, I've been obsessed with it my whole life, for the most part. You know, my first bike, I didn't even have cranks on it. Just coast down the hill and have a blast in the neighborhood, you know? Just ride gravel roads for all day, kill yourself, and then drink a bunch of beer at the end. So yeah, that was pretty quick. I just had to do the insides. We're the bike people. We, we ride home at the end of the day. We see people riding on the street. We look at their bike, what kind of the bike they're riding, how they fit on that bike. We look at that. And you see some people riding and they don't look right on that bike. Like, bike's just too stretched out for them or they're too upright. If you see someone on a custom bike, it's like they belong on that bike. People get to choose favorite colors, how they want us to execute it. You get to make someone's dream bike happen. This particular model won the Bicycling Magazine, like Dream Bike of the Year twice, which is the only bike to ever do that. One of the coolest parts about working here is we get to ride bikes that we make and they're really, really nice. When I first started here, it was mostly stock. You could add options. It was a point where people wanted so much. I want a longer top tube, I want this, I want that. It just became like almost every bike was getting option to the max. And the whole industry started to go to that. Our inserts, they are made by Envy. For our seat posts, every batch we get, I have to take them out of the box and make sure it fits in every single one, but they always do. To do this paint scheme is about 20, 25 hours, maybe. Not really rushed through it, it's just gonna be perfect. This is gonna be someone's favorite bike best bike they've ever owned you know it's gonna inspire them to get out because they're gonna look at that bike and be like all they think about is getting a ride in and so sometimes you you know you forget that but it's basically it makes it okay you know everybody at IF who's worked on the frame signs the hang tag why would you walk a mile and you could ride a bike a mile it'd be so much faster and so much cooler and less work so when you see pedestrians, you just like shit. Oh yeah, I scream at them. Get a bike. <laughs>